Hello friends, it's Nia. Welcome to Life with Nia. Today we are planning the week in the Daily Petite Planner. I don't know why we are still bringing the Daily Petite Planner in 2022 other than I just cannot let it go. So here it is. Um, so we have a brand new Daily Petite Planner for the first quarter of 2022, January through March. And um, I've got it all set up in the little protective sleeve, and um, I have done a month at a glance. This is from Planner Kate. I do like how she's got the whole end-to-end -end, um, for the top washi strip, but I don't like the, that you have to add the dates on yourself. I don't, you don't like that, but it's fine. Anyway, um, so... For this week, um, I used some washi from Simply Gilded. I don't remember what this is from. But it may have been recent. The um, it may have been the the. Uh, I think actually it was the um, August presale that came in like October November. Um, it's one of the blues. You know I can't stay away from the blue. So I used that. It's very to me winter and Christmas blue. Well, it's not Christmas, but winter blue. Um, and so I'm going to be using that. And then I went into my stash and pulled out these This Is Us stickers. This was um, the collab with Jameson Reed. There were like, I think, five collabs. I have never used these. I, I really like Jameson Reed. I have ordered from her before on Etsy. Um, and the shop info is there if you're interested in checking out her shop. I've gotten some really, really cute things, some dashboards and things. I should go look and see if she has any for like, because oh, when I bought them, they were for my Happy Planner Classic size. I should go see if there's any for like half letter size. Okay, shiny things. Um, But I, I think I've had these for about two years and I've never used them. So we're going to use these this week. Um, I had a fleeting thought of I wonder what would happen if I used like stickers that I actually have here on hand for a whole year instead of buying them. I'm not saying that's what I'm going to do, but I'm just like, I wonder what that would look like. Considering I have things that I've never even tested out before, be all fresh and new and interesting. Anyway, um, we're going to do our normal um, strips. So our top three and our to-dos and let's see if I have a clean color dot in here to use so for this week I am not busy in the sense of external things to do but I have a lot of things that I want to get done um, I am like I pause. I am like committed <laughs> to working on the back end of Shopify today, which is Sunday. Um, I don't know when I'm going to put this video up, but I am committed to that. So um, I might do that while this video is uploading, but I really want to um, make that a priority for this month and so I'm going to be working on that. Um, I need to put this desk together that I bought in June so I'm going to be working on that um, and I don't know that it's going to take me an exorbitant amount of time but geez it's a lot of pieces. Um, it's the, the Alex desk and drawers. So I don't think the desk is a lot but the drawers Knowing me, I will put something together backwards and have to take it apart and redo it, which is annoying, but I don't have a problem putting things together. It's just, will it be correct? Um, so, um, that is on my list of things to do. And once I get that done, I can organize my planner supplies and things that I want to... Um, not just actually planner supplies, but business things, because I want to move all of that 
off of my kitchen table because I've been using my kitchen table instead of my office because I spend so much time printing and cutting that I would be sitting in this cold room without access to like a TV or anything and that just does not sound fun. So I want to um, get that all moved. The other thing is once I get a setup that is good for and like I don't even know if it's gonna work because number of outlets and whatnot but once I get a setup that's good I can run both silhouette machines and cut faster there's some there's some art that I want to work on designing um, I want to work on um, I feel like I'm Monday morning quarterbacking on this one because it's two weeks away, but I have something that I wanted to do for Martin Luther King, um, which can carry over into Black History Month. I am going to have last year's Black, PD says hi, Black History Month kit available, but I'm also working on some new Black History Month items. Um, what else am I working on? These stickers are cute. I don't know why I didn't use these. I don't know what was going on, but I, was, I didn't pull them out and enjoy them. But that's okay, because they're perfect for now. So we have our planner time. Um... See, what else am I gonna do? I uh, I I need to film a bunch of stuff. There is the I think final budget series video. Um which is sort of just a recap of everything and flip through of the final. There is the January budget setup video, which I think I'm changing up a little bit how I do it. Um, there is the half letter filming. There is the dun, 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 A5 Daily Duo. Pretty so excited about that. So like my list of stuff I need to get done, I can't wait to get like all of that listed out in the A5 Daily Duo because that was really what I wanted that planner for. And um, the hardest thing for me right now is picking a kit to use for the first week but we will overcome that obstacle. So I have that going on as well. Um, let's see, what else do I need to do? Oh, I need to pay some bills, because you know it's payday. Um, I'm pretty excited about the savings challenges. I think that um, I think the savings challenges are going to help me. Um, like when I'm really sitting down and looking at stuff, I kind of have Sam's afterpay. I kind of have a good amount of money left over after paying bills, but I buy planner stuff, and so. How about now? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do that, but it's just like, ma'am, leave the planner stuff alone. Okay, I think I'm going to make this a grocery list down here. And there's still a bazillion stickers left in those books. 
So I might carry that over onto another planner this week. See what clean colored dot we have. I think I actually would like to use gray, and the gray is in the other room. But it's regular blue. Something the denim blue might work. It's fine. Okay, so I'm going to use the clean color dot in denim. I did not look up the weather, but I think it's supposed to rain Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday or something like that, which is why I'm not really trying to go look it up because this negativity I don't need in my life. I am ready for summer to come back. Just let it all just be dry and parched outside. <laughs> because I am freezing. I'm freezing. I feel like it is extraordinarily cold here. Um, and if you don't know, I'm in California. So this is like not normal in my opinion. I don't remember it ever being this cold. And I don't remember. It's definitely been rainy in the past. But um, it's cold and rainy. It's not cold enough for it to turn to snow that's not where I live but um, it's like high 30s and then I think yesterday um, like the high only got into the 40s it's like there's not much variation in between the low and the high and um, they were actually saying like New Year's Eve in Times Square like the low was 52, but we were 40 degrees. And so it's like for it to be colder in California than it is in New York is a problem for me. It's a serious problem. Um, nothing I can do about it, but I feel some kind of way. Because we don't do that here. Okay, so. Let me just add in a little sprinkle more of dolls let's go to our empty trash day oh yeah there's a little garbage um Okay, so this is what I have for this week in the Daily Petite Planner. I still feel like we're unbalanced over here. Hold, oh, please. Let's see if there's anything else. Just add a little something. Okay, now I think we're really done. So this is the week of January 3rd through the 9th in the Daily Petite Planner first 
full week we are planning out in a new daily petite planner for the quarter of January through March and um, I'm really not changing how I do anything I might at some point go back to putting my time strips down but for right now I just really don't need them the day just drags on very quickly it's not really dragging it's just there's it's so busy and there's so much going on that um, nothing is getting truly scheduled it's just hey we have this meeting in two seconds <laughs> um, and you're there so just rolling with it so that is my week I hope you enjoyed this video and got some ideas for planning in your own planner if you're new and you'd consider subscribing, I would greatly appreciate it. If you um, are new or returning and you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button. It does help the channel grow, and I do enjoy having a community um, here on YouTube with you all. So thanks for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye.